and happening now. Lawmakers have less than a week to pass a new farm bill. It's the largest piece of federal legislation for food and farming across the country. GMS Lorena Rivas has more on how the delay with the bill is affecting farmers here in East Texas. Brady McKinnis is the owner of McKinnis Farms in Mount Alba. As a first-generation farmer, he needed extra help to kickstart his career. He used several of their young farmer uh, startup loans and young farmer uh, low interest rate uh, lines of credit. These services are among many that are funded by the Farm Bill, which covers programs ranging from disaster relief to crop insurance. This crop insurance allows us on a year like this year where we had a failed crop, getting our money back and, and getting restarted for next year. I mean, without it, I'd be out of business. The Farm Bill is renewed every five years. Right now, farmers are still under the 2018 version after U.S. lawmakers did not pass a new one last year. Our national security is at stake if we don't support the farmers and ranchers who are growing the food that goes to the grocery stores. Joe Gilson is a director of government affairs for the American Farm Bureau Federation. They were among 300 U.S. organizations that urged Congress to pass the long-delayed Farm Bill. In the previous five years, the United States lost about 140,000 farms. And so it's not uncommon to see farmers that decide to go out of business because the economics just aren't working. Gilson says there's two reasons why the Farm Bill is stuck in Congress. How much we should be spending on the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program and some around the commodity programs about how much support uh, should we provide to farmers to make sure that they can stay in business. And a delay in a new Farm Bill puts additional funding on hold for farmers like McKinnis. If that doesn't get passed, I won't. I mean, there's no way I could afford to, to purchase crop insurance for next year. The lawmakers have until next Monday to pass a new farm bill. If they don't, they may extend the current one for another year.